Okay, we're back with Pokemon. So, the goal for this video is to beat Maylene and to beat uh, Crasher Wake. But if we only beat Maylene this vid, that's good enough. But we should be able to beat Crasher Wake too. What's this, Apom? Exciting stuff. So, uh, I have a bit of a story to tell. So, I, I'm recording this right after I recorded the last one, like part three. So, I, I just want to talk about this real quick because I forgot to bring it up last time, but it's really funny. I might even bring it up during the next Paper Mario as well, just in case, like, people aren't watching that, they're watching this. But effectively, I'll, just, I'll edit that out, I had to clear my throat really bad, it was game Flemmy. Um, effectively, what happened was, at around four in the morning, I was editing. And I get a text from my friend, and he's like, Yo, you want to see my 50-inch? I've got a picture for you. And I'm like, excuse me? And he's like, yo, my 50-inch, here. And then he sends me the picture, and it's a 50-inch fucking 4K TV. But the way it was termed made it sound like it was something else. And, and it was really funny because I'm just sitting there like, um, what do you mean 50 inches? And he's like, yeah, my 50 inch. And like I said, he sends me a picture. It means a TV. I, I kind of knew he meant it because he and I were actually playing Blackout that same day, like the, the actual day before. And he was like, I need to get myself a new TV. And then 4 a.m., the next morning, he's like, yo, let me send you a picture of my 50 inches. And I'm just like, um... Yeah, no, that sounds like something else. And then I get another text from his sister. Actually, not a text, sorry. Apologies, that's wrong. I was in voice chat with his sister playing, uh, again, Blackout. And I'm just like, hey, your brother showed me his 50 inch last night. And she goes, what the fuck? And I'm like, she's like, oh, you mean the TV? And I'm like, yes. But God, does it sound like something else? So that was my morning at 4 a.m. I, I went from editing Spider-Man, like the, the compilation for Spider-Man, to thinking my best friend basically was going to show me his fucking 50-inch penis at 4 in the morning. And now I've passed on this wonderful story to everyone else. Because it needs to be shared with the rest of the world. The world must know. The world must know of the penis TV story. Also, I'm pretty sure if I had actually been here during the day, I could have gotten a, uh, an A-Palm. Pretty sure A-Palm's on this route. Okay, there we go. Uh, bird up is there. Okay, we should be able to take out these two. Um, I don't think he was supposed to turn like that. But yeah, we should be able to do this, and then we should be able to, uh, beat Maylene. Hopefully. Hopefully she doesn't wipe my whole team out of existence. But, like I said in the last video, my... The strat for Maylene is effectively just getting one sacrifice Pokemon. I don't know uh, who I'm going to swap out of the team for that, but... Uh, let's let's focus on the Stunky. I feel like the Stunky's more dangerous. You know, with their combination of Stunky and Glam, yeah, they should try out for Team Galactic. So yeah, I've been um, I've been working on the Spider-Man compilation. I'm trying to get it done. I've I've had a hard time motivating myself to do it, but I mean the nice thing is there are quite a few videos later where I feel like I'll just breeze through the editing process just because like there were things in them that were just long periods of time where I'm silent because there's just nothing to do or talk about. No, actually I should conserve my bites. I'll just tackle it. Same thing goes for the Stunky. 
Gotta love them double battles that take forever to load. But yeah, um, I was gonna record Paper Mario, but I'm just like, I'm too tired and I don't have enough time. I mean, granted, it's gonna be like 11 o'clock by the time I'm done with this. 11.40 might even be. I mean, I started at 9.40, so if we go two hours with this. I hope we can avoid doing a two-hour video, but... That said, I really do have to make some progress. Uh, okay, I need to go back. I need to go and buy some antidotes. I didn't realize I'm not... I don't have any. I had to use Pecha Berries. I had to unironically use Pecha Berries. Why did I go in here? That's not a Pokemart. That's a Pokemon Center. Person Berries. Yes. I think those heal confusion. I don't. I don't know. Banana Berries. It says n like Nanab, but it's Banan backwards. Good Banan. Okay. Good. Sell. Sell the revive because we can't use it anyway. Sell the X accuracy because it's useless. Uh, sell the figgy berry because we don't need it. Uh, banana berry. Yes, there we go. Beautiful. Okay, uh, what else can we sell? We have a calcium. Uh, let's give that to Ghastly, actually. Actually, no, let's give it to uh, Big Venus, because he's going to learn Flamethrower, and we need him to have the best special attack possible. Okay, uh, let me look at the state my Pokemon are in. Bird up's close to evolving, so is Bolt. Uh, I can't remember if Psyduck evolves at a certain level or if it needs a War Stone, though. We're gonna battle as many people as we can. We need the XP. So yeah, we're gonna. We're gonna do all of this. We're gonna at least beat Maylene, and I think we should be able to take out Crasher Wake because I'm just saying there's not many trainers on the way to him. Now there is some backtracking, but I don't remember if we get Fly or not. I don't know if we get Fly yet. Yeah, actually, I think we get it right after we beat Maylene, right? Because we we help Dawn battle like two. Team Galactic guys, and she gives it to us, I want to say. I don't remember. It's something along the lines of that, but I have no memory of how we actually get it. Because if I'm remembering right, we get Surf from Cynthia's grandmother. She just kleptomanias the shit out of her, uh... She just raids her bedroom, apparently, and gives us her fucking personal items. Thank God she didn't give us something else. You know what I'm talking about. You know what I mean when I say something else. It's it's something you would find in a drawer of a certain shape. Bird up gained a level. He's like, I think, one level off from evolving. Screech. No, I don't want a screaming duck. I'm good. I can only imagine what a screaming duck must sound like. Something he tells me it, it would sound a lot like the Nostalgia Critic screaming. A sound which is so high-pitched, I can't imitate it. God, movement is just such a fucking mess. Um... What you got? Kahilil... Kalil? I don't know how to say your name. I hate you, though. Pichu. 
Motherfucking peach, you motherfucker. Look at this, this dude. Quick attack the shit out of him. So yeah, I'm I'm pulling an all-nighter tonight as well. I'm gonna get the uh, the third Pokemon video added, as well as probably like part eight of Paper Mario because I still have to edit that down. And then tomorrow night I'm gonna record uh, part nine of Paper Mario and get that done. So I mean I'm getting a bunch of stuff recorded. Like I said, I'm expecting to get sick at some point because I know me. I always get sick in February, and I'm like, I don't, I don't want to get fucked up again and not have anything, so. Rick Gastly leveled. I guess we'll find out if it evolves into Gengar. Like, I mean, uh, Haunter right now. I said Gengar. I'm proud of me. Oh, of course. God, wouldn't it be ironic death by Happiny. Please die. Bird up. God, it would be really nice if there was a heal house soon. Something tells me there isn't. Yes, Rick Astley's evolving. Yes, floating arms boy for the win. Shadow punch. Uh, isn't that physical? But it never misses. No, it's not worth it. It looks good on paper, but when it's from a Pokemon that has no physical attacks, not much point. Yes, fight me. Let me beat the shit out of your Pokemon. I just realized I didn't heal Staravia. I'm gonna have to get Staravia out of there. Oh god, she's got a chest burster too. No. Yeah, we need to swap. Uh, let's send... Send Macho after it. This macho should be fine, as long as it doesn't, like, use Dazzling Gleam or some shit. See, now I'm very confused, too, because I could have sworn that all of the, uh, all the Gen 1, like, the trade trio Pokemon, like, they just all evolved at the same level, but... Oh. Oh. You are a problem. I do not like you. Yeah, I need to get Macho out of there. He's going to get the shit murdered out of him if I don't. Uh, let's send in Luxray. I mean Luxio. He's going to be a Luxray soon. I'm tempted to actually use a rare candy. But I don't know if I should. Oh yes, we can buy Moo Moo Milk. I'm pretty sure we can buy Moo Moo Milk. Moo Moo Milk is a fun word. You know what's not fun? Male Breast Milk. Nah, who am I kidding? Male Breast Milk's a delightful topic. You saw the compilation. You may not have seen it in the original source material video, but you saw the compilation, you know. You know what I'm talking about. You know the insanity that I speak of. Bruh. Yeah, I'm tackling you. Goodbye. Big Venus leveled. Shock it. Par paralyze it. No! Oh, that doesn't show up on the uh, the capture, but I had to adjust my headset and it got a little creaky for a second.
Please stop. Why are you like this? Why are you the way that you are? No, stop. Well, that was a crazy flip he just did. Please stop killing my Luxio. Oh, of course it can only use Thunder Shock. Please hit it. Yes. It's dead. Get your crazy space alien out of here. That's great. I'm gonna heal now because I almost just had a team wipe because of stupidity. Paralyze heal. Uh, we need to use... Where is it? Chesto Berry. Alright, yes. How much is Moo Moo Milk? How much? Oh, I didn't realize you were a trainer. Oh, no. She's cute. 10 out of 10. Wood bang. 100%. Even though she has a Xenomorph. Please kill this thing. Oh, it's still quite alive. Yes, good good job, bird up. Now kill it. Good. Good burb. Rubber Ducky leveled. That's good. What point do I get Golduck? Yes, I would love. I'll buy 10 of them. I'll take your entire stock. So they're 500 each. Moo Moo Milk is 500, heals 100, as opposed to Super Potions, which cost 700, and heals 60. Yeah, we're stocking up on Moo Moo Milk. Moo Moo Milk the game. I'm maxing out my stock. How much do we have now? 40, we'll buy, we'll buy 10 more, bring us up to 50, and then we'll, at the next opportunity, sell our super potions. We don't need them. They're inferior. Oh, I thought you were going to fight me. Collector Edwin. He's got a tree. This silly lad. So he's probably gonna use a rock type move on, like a uh, move on me because I'm a burb. So, um, this is definitely something Macho would be useful for. Is killing this this fake tree, this smiling fake tree. He's fraudulent. Oh, this is going to be delightfully easy. That was. Next to no damage you did. That hurt significantly more. But you're still dead. Macho leveled. Really? We may have found the lost fisherman relative. This is Pseudo Wudo Man. He only has Pseudo Wudo. That did a lot of damage, I didn't like that. Deck him right in the face. Punch him in the face like a bitch. 
Suda Wudo. I'm Suda. But I'm not Suda. Suda is a different YouTuber. I'm I'm Discount Vine Sauce is what I am. I know what I am. I'm aware of my brand. Oh Jesus. You need to die. Oh boy. Wow. Yeah, you did a lot of damage to me. I didn't like that. I didn't like that one bit. You're you're quite the asshole. Yes. Get Machoke Me Daddy. Yes. He's slightly bigger now. He's bigger and his skin is darker, and that's the only difference. Oh, now he put on underpants, which he didn't have before. But other than that, the same exact Pokemon as as previously. Well, it looks like we won't be able to sell the super potions at this rate with the amount we've had to use. Okay. What you got? What you got, Fernando? Mr. Mime. I don't like that thing. It frightens me. It makes me feel fear. Also, I hate to break it to you, but I'm kind of the killer of Mr. Mimes. Again, if you watched the compilation or you watched part 6 of the of the actual Pokemon playthrough, you'll know I committed the Mr. Mime Holocaust in order to grind. I, I'm not I'm not calling it anything else. It was pretty much the Mr. Mime Holocaust. I killed at least 200 of them. At least 200. Please stop making me burn my aerial aces. I need those. There's a whole gym coming up where I'm gonna need them. Yes, good level. Rick Gasly, he's never gonna give you up. He's never gonna let you down. Oh. Really? It lasts even though I killed the Mr. Mime? Okay. Whatever. Kill it. Rubber ducky leveled. Big Venus. Good. So I beat up everyone here. Great. Two fifteen. This is a new route. We need to switch to Haunter because he's got hypnosis. I can't get that. I had one of those and it died. Can we get an F for my Cricketune? Is there anything new? I feel like we haven't seen anything new on any route in fucking forever. Like, legitimately? Oh! Oh shit, I get one chance at this. Unless... Wait. I can't remember... Does it have speed priority? Well, only one way to find out. Yes, we can catch it. Yo, we can have the holy trinity of Pokemon that will never fully evolve. We can get Kadabra, we can get Haunter, and Machoke. And none of them will ever evolve, ever. I don't know why I use the thing that's actually worse than regular Pokeball. That was really unintelligent of me. You know what else is really stupid of me? I have a Great Ball I can use. It drastically increase the odds of catching this thing. Yes. Yes, it sleeps 18 hours a day. 
as opposed to me who stays awake 18 hours a day. Or more like 24 hours a day. What do we name this thing? What do we name it? Um... Uh, what, what? Can we name it Al Capocus? Like, uh, uh, in reference to the, uh... Al, uh, ca po uh, kiss? I feel like that's wrong. I feel like it's not K, but... I feel like the whole spelling of that wrong, it, like, is wrong. That was good words. It, it's a reference to Bugs Bunny. Oh, we are not using that thing. Nope, not with those stats. Goodbye. Well, at least we caught a thing. I'm, I'm gonna keep Haunter up because this guy's gonna have... He's gonna have Bronzor, probably. And I can use Hex on him. Uh, your face didn't look like it fully rendered there. Bronzru. See, now it's not Rick Gasly anymore. Now it's Rick Haunter. And it loses something. Yeah, bye. Haunter is absurdly good. That is a problem. Put to sleep. Close those motherfucking eyes. To quote Samuel L. Jackson, go the fuck to sleep. Curse you, sturdy. We'll just use a payback on it. There, it's dead. It's it's fucking dead. Easy. Easy mode. Oh, we almost have Luxray. We are so close to Luxray. I'll take that. That's highly valuable. Hello, Karate Man. I have something for you. It's a burb. Oh, it's payback. Never mind. Actually, is there anything that can use payback? Wait. Uh, Macho can, but he already has revenge and that stab and does more damage. Yes, fight me. What you got? Crow gunk. I have something for that. I have burb. And best of all, I have burb that can't miss. Kill it. Fucking kill it. It's dead. It it's dead. We did it. He's Gonzo. Macho leveled. So I think for what we're going to do for Maylene is I think Haunter is probably the answer to that whole situation. Oh, God damn it! We need to go up here. I forgot this guy's just chilling here guarding this one singular item for all eternity. Because apparently he has nothing better to do with his life. What you got? What Pokemons? What Pokermans how do you has? Metatite. I can kill that. Kill its stupid little diaper wearing ass. Fuck you. There, it's dead. Goodbye. Will not be missed. Another Machop. Easy. Easy money. 
And best of all, we get Luxray off of this. Yes. And then they're Meditite. Kill it, Fairy Lace. Yes, it's dead. Good. Gurgle. Yes. Yes, good. Okay, just look at my Pokemon. I, I opened up the menu to cough, so I might as well look at my Pokemon while I'm in here. Okay, so everything's gonna level up pretty soon. Fist plate. I can get good at fisting. Ooh, berries. Yes, give me all the berries. Luck berries. Those are useless to me. But they're they're good self fodder and fodder. I said fodder. I'm proud of that. I'm I'm so good at words. I swear. My wording skills are like top level. See how good I word? Guard spec dot exclamation point. Guard spec dot exe has stopped responding. Would you like to restart the program? Hello, Mr. Karate Guy. Will you please stop being an annoying cunt? I mean, we've already evolved, like, two Pokemon this video. Actually, three Pokemon, because Machoke Hunter and, uh, Luxray. I feel like everything's just gonna evolve this video. Except maybe the Psyduck. I'm not sure. I stupidly didn't look up between videos what Psyduck evolves with. But if it evolves in its level 20s, we'll know, we'll know that's the thing. I mean, it's already level, like, what, 23, 24? I don't know, I, I'm not paying attention. I should be. Quick attack, I need to conserve my aerial aces. I always forget that Faint has, like, the highest, like, speed priority of any move in Pokemon. Like, it even outspeeds Protect and Detect. Except, like, it sucks, so it doesn't really matter that it does. Okay, well, this thing's getting aerial aced. Because this thing could probably do actual damage to my Staravia, and I'd really like to avoid that. Yes. He's dead. We done killed him good. Poker ball. Shockwave. That reminds me, do we have anything that can actually learn that? Unfortunately, Haunter cannot. Uh... Uh, what can learn? Oh, it can learn Rock Tomb. That's tempting. Yeah, nothing really. Okay. Full heal. That's useful. Uh, oh, I should probably heal Staravia before fighting these people. Potion up. Not gonna bother using a super potion. Double Bataru. What you got? Well, I can aerial ace the Monferno.
I didn't think your own tempo stopped Intimidate. I swear, maybe they just changed a bunch of moves and I haven't been paying attention. I don't know. That's a dead monkey. Oh, monkey fella. Carl, what the fuck are you talking about? You know, little monkey fella. Flame wheel. Is that physical or special? It's physical. No. Don't bother learning it. Big Venus, you're better than that. Big Venus doesn't have to stoop to that level. You know why? Because he's big motherfucking Venus. No, that's physical. Kadabra. And what else? Oh, gay Rados. As a gay dose. Okay, I'm gonna quick attack the Kadabra and I'm going to use Thunder Shock on the Gyarados. It didn't die in one hit, that's unfortunate. But that definitely died in one hit. Probably because it's four times a week. That's fine, it's about to die. God, I can't wait to heal after fighting frickin' Maylene and her stupid goddamn gym full of bullshit. Yes, good. Shut up and give me your wallet. Uh, it really sounds like I'm mugging them there, but... You got the two Wikipedia berries. Okay. I need to heal. Oh, but I can't. I can't go to the center. Damn it, that's right. Okay. Um, we should first go to the uh, department store and buy some TMs. Because there's some TMs that we could definitely use. Uh, what? So we need the third floor. Okay. Yes. Uh, so low sweep we don't need. Bulldoze. Tempting. False swipe might be good for catching things. We need to go make sure we can buy everything over here first that we need to buy. Uh, so flamethrower. Yes. Uh, Thunderbolt, I don't know if, see, this is the weird thing, I don't know if anything can learn that. I'm buying Dazzling Gleam, like, uh, Dazzling Gleam, I don't know if anything can learn it, but, God, will that be useful if I actually can. Okay, so, Dazzling Gleam can be learned by Rick Gasly, thank God. We need Fairy-type coverage. We need it so badly. Let's get rid of Payback, we don't need that. Great. No, it's not what I wanted. Oh wow, yeah. It can't learn it for some reason, but Macho can. What the fuck? Can somebody explain to me why my Macho can learn Flamethrower, but my Ghost can't? Let's get rid of Ember. F like, Flamethrower is literally just bare Ember, so. Uh, what else can we, we teach our good pal Haunter here? Psychic. Well, you know what can learn Psychic? I don't know if it can learn it yet, but Golduck can definitely learn that. Uh, Ice Beam will be useful for much later in the game, if something can learn it. I think we have pretty much everything we need. Let me just see. 
Oh, Sida can learn Psychic. Yes. Uh, get rid of Confusion, because, again... Uh, actually, you know what? Get rid of Fury Swipes, because I'm just looking at how little PP Psychic actually has. I'm like, uh... Yeah. Let's, uh, let's avoid that for now. Oh, it can learn Ice Beam. Yes, good. Get rid of Disable. Psyduck is best duck. Confirmed. We have now confirmed that Psyduck is in fact best duck. There are no better ducks than Psyduck. Right, we need False Swipe. Uh, I also think Star Raptor can learn U-Turn, or Star Ravia, rather. So that's good. Uh, let's see. Nothing can learn False Swipe, but yes, Bird Up can learn U-Turn, and I will teach it that. Uh, get rid of Tackle. Yes, good. Actually, wait, were there any other, uh, status moves? I didn't pay attention. I don't know if Toxic was available. Uh... No, it doesn't seem like it. No. Okay. Well, that's fine. Uh, what, what else can we do? What else can we do? I mean, ideally, I want Haunter to learn Will-O-Wisp, but... It's a shame we can't learn Flamethrower in this game. Uh, let's... You know what? We'll keep Bird up for the first couple of fights, and then we'll send in Haunter. And Dazzling Gleam the shit out of half the Machokes in that gym. Right, there might be a rival battle here. Oh no, it's just Dawn. Okay, bye. Okay, I just had to edit out a coughing fit. It's fine. Just want to make sure Bird Up is... Yes, Bird Up is in slot one. Jeffrey. Jeffrey, and he is Machoke. He is Machoke me daddy. Lower its attack. Oh no. Why are you so bulky? Oh, it's still alive. Thank God. Well, seeing that he can't really do much to me, I'm just gonna keep aerial acing him. It's fine. Good, it's dead. Bird up leveled. Bolt got a level. I don't know when Bird Up evolves. I can't remember if it's 32 or 36. If it's 32, we're getting ourselves a uh, a Star Raptor this game. Like this play session. I mean, I think regardless, we're getting a Star Raptor, but. Um, send in Rick Gastly. Someone tells me he used a fighting type move on me. Yep, you fool. Now, you must die. Bruh. Stop. Dead. Gone, reduced to atoms. Honestly, I'd say, like, I'd go out and just fight 
Wait, actually, I just realized if I can actually make it all the way over to that, uh, that beach area, I can one time use that thing to heal. Okay, yeah, I, I got a plan. I got a plan. So we'll fight all the karate guys in this gym, and then we'll go down to the route below us. We'll catch whatever's there, although I don't think there's anything new on that route. Battle all the trainers there, like, over there, and then heal. Because we're allowed to heal due to the, uh, the claws with the one-time healing. It's gonna suck not to be able to use that gate ever again, but I'm just looking at how worn down everything is, and I'm like, oof, yeah, we, we need to heal before we take on Maylene, because I'm just remembering that Lucario, and I'm like, oof. Ow. No. Quick attack it. Should finish it off. Yes. The choke me daddy is dead. Another Machoke Me Daddy. Really? Yep, we are out of Aerial Ace. And it didn't even die. Also, you're cheating. You have a level 25 Machoke and it doesn't evolve until 28. This is bullshit. I call cheats and hacks. Macho's level 30. Rubber Ducky got to 25. Rick Gasly at 28. Big Venus. Machop. Machop. Quick attack it. No. Goodbye. I'm gonna get the fuck out of this situation. Nope, 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 nope. Uh, let's just send Rick Gasly out. Oh, but I thought I couldn't miss. I thought it couldn't miss. But it did. And now you're dead. So for the next fight, I think I'm just going to lead with Haunter. And just like Dazzling Gleam everything I see. Because I would send in Rubber Ducky, but I'm a little kind of, like, concerned that he's not quite up to the challenge yet. Like, after a couple more levels, I'll feel more comfortable with it, but currently I'm like, uh, I don't know if I want to send in Psyduck. It seems a little dangerous. I'm a little worried about it. It seems like it could end very poorly. And considering I just spent, like, three TMs on that thing, I kind of want it to live. Well, this is easy. Fairy type moves for the win. Wow. That was it? A, a single Metatite? Mate, you dense. Mate, you fucking dense. You fucking Metatite. Oh, mate. Fuck's that shit, mate. Fucking meta type. Okay, take this guy out. I think there's only one more karate guy we have to fight after him. And then we'll go down to the route. We'll take out all those guys. And then we'll heal at the gate. And then we'll come back and beat the shit out of Maylene and destroy her hopes and dreams. Because it's really funny to destroy children's hopes and dreams. Because by the time you're an adult, you don't have any of those. Like, they're they're gone. They've been gone a while. Like, once reality sets in, that's when you truly start to give up. Positivity. I'm a very positive person. As you can tell. Machoke me, daddy. Machoke me hard. Machoke me until I pass out. You're fucking dead.
Yes. Level. Okay. Let me out. Let me out. Oh, I see. Well, if I keep going up this way. Oh, there's no one up there. Okay, so I think I've beaten them all. So I'm going to go out now. And we're going to go down this route. And as much as I would love to get my stylish fucking Haunch Crow gear, something tells me it's not really an option. Also, was that man mid-run animation when I walked in? Okay. Oh, this is fine. I'll just hack some. That's good. He's got ghost types, or psychic types, I mean. I can just use hacks on him. It's all good. Rick Gasly. No, I have the true Rick Gasly. Die, bitch. Dead. D E D. Kadabra. I should still be faster than you, so it's fine. Yep, you're dead. Mistrevis. I wonder actually if we keep going down, I wonder if we can fight Crash or Wake. I just saw that. Bird up leveled. Take down. No, why would I ever learn that? That's a terrible move. Don't learn that. Right, there's also the guy on this route with the three ponyta because for some reason he just went all in on ponyta. Yeah, I don't know why. He was just like, yes. He's probably as sick with fucking Steelix as I am, so he's like, no. No Steelix will ever piss me off ever again. Citrus. Oh, those are actually decent. No, I want this this tree. Small tree. Yes, X special defense. Good. What you got? I don't even remember you. What is this? P.I. Carlos. I remember joking about your name. Oh, he's got weaponized Magikarps. That's right. It's fine. I'll just Dazzling Gleam it. What else you got? Big Venus leveled. Good. Oh, another Goldeen. Fantastic. It's dead, too. Or apparently not. Apparently it's slightly bulkier than the other Goldeen. You know what? I'm just going to do myself a favor here. I'm just going to switch to Bolt. This guy clearly went out and all in on Goldeen. He's like, yes, I want all the Goldeen. Stop that. That's very annoying. Tackle it. It's dead. Good. Oh my god. No, Goldeen? Really? Why is it I feel like the trainers in this game are just like super repetitive? Because I'm just thinking of our Pokemon games. I'm thinking like your standard youngster having like a Nidoran and a Rattata. And now I'm just thinking about this game where it's like Goldeen for days. Glammeow for days. Starly for days. It's like all the same Pokemon. 
Speaking of all the same Pokemon, here comes Mr. Fucking Ponyta Man and his very tasteful Deviant Art account, I'm sure. Collector Brady and his Ponyta. His pretty pony that has GameCube level fucking fire on it. Shoot water on it. Kill it. Good duck. Excellent duck. To quote we happy few, that's a very charismatic duck. Ooh, Nightshade. That's way better than Confuse Ray, yes. That's also a really easy catch move. Just water pulse it again, it's fine. It's dead. Imagine I go all the way down here and then I find out, oh, I'm not able to heal. Like, after all this, what if I just try and, like, I just try and do the trick to get to Volkner? Because, I mean, I I opened the menu right as I was about to fight that one trainer, so what if I try to do it again and I just go fight Volkner and get his bitch? Yes. Strength. That's not a bad move. Uh, it's normal though. It's not really any value of me learning it, to be honest. That's great. Never speak to me or my son ever again. And by my son, I mean the Psyduck. Good lad, that Psyduck. I'm going to kill you with my duck now. Ducks are good boys. We like ducks. They're better than Canadian geese. Canadian geese are assholes. But ducks are good boys. Ducks are great. Everyone likes ducks. You know why everyone likes ducks? Because they're, they're fine lads. Joke's on you. I'm not psychic type. You are dead though. Very, very dead. One might even go as far as to say cadaverific. Corpse tacular. Soak. What is soak? No, that's fucking terrible. Why would you ever learn that? Wow. I didn't mean to fight you. I didn't I didn't mean to fight you. What do you have? Psychic Mitchell. Psychic Mitchell. Oh, that's good. I can use Psychic on that and kill it. Rubber Ducky. Again, I didn't think about this because when it evolves, it's no longer going to look like a Rubber Ducky. I've made mistakes. Joke's on you, my Psyduck's always confused. It has no idea where it is or what it's doing. It's like the Hulk. Like, Psyduck walks up to the Haunter, he's like, That's the thing. That's my secret. I'm always confused. And they just blast it with, like, a Yu-Gi-Oh! style, like, Mind Crush. Oh, that's a problem. Um... Someone tells me I need to switch Pokemon here. Someone tells me my my rubber duck fellow may not survive fighting Spoon Boy. Why does he have a spoon? I, like, I, yeah, it's a reference to, like, telekinesis, but... Why the spoon? He's dead now. Can we get an F for that Kadabra? Yes.
We need to heal. I just thought of that. Good. Fight me. I don't know what you have, but fight me. Oh, you know what I forgot to grab? I forgot to grab the Eevee when we were in Heart Home. Oops. Oh well, I can do it when I go back there later. I, I was in a rush last video because I was like, shit, we're like an hour in and I still haven't gotten any progress made whatsoever. Dead. Psyduck is kind of strong, like low key. He's kind of overpowered and I love him. I love my duck. My duck is awesome. I've become very obsessed with this Psyduck. I don't know why. I went from killing one in the compilation with gunfire to... Oh, Jesus Christ! Okay, you're gonna... You need to die. You threaten my duck. I don't like that. I don't like people who threaten my duck. He's a good lad. He has psychic powers, too. Now, I question, is psychokinesis something that all ducks, like, have? inherently or is this like a specific trait of Psyduck like has anyone tested this do we know if do we know if real life ducks have telekinesis can they read thoughts can they read minds okay I'm going to U-turn you now, and I hope you die in one hit. That is rather unfortunate. Alright, Big Venus, this is your time to shine. Why you gotta do this? Burn. Yes, big Venus leveled. He's an even bigger Venus than he was before. Neither duck nor horse. Oh yeah, I guess we should catch something while we're here. Oh yeah, I should also heal Psyduck because it occurs to me it's kind of dying. There we go. Anything? Anything new? Oh, looks Geodude. Geodude is new Zubat confirmed. I've literally seen Geodude everywhere in this goddamn game. I don't know why. Geodudes are so insanely common, but they are a thing, apparently. Everywhere. Well, we have that already. No. Stop it. You're inconveniencing me. Stop. There's also a trainer up here I didn't fight. What you got? What you have? He's got one Pokemon. It's a shield on. Awesome. I can kill that with Water Pulse. And by kill, I mean lower to 1 HP, because everything in this game has goddamn sturdy. Oh no. By the way, can I just say Gen 4 has the worst fossil Pokemon? Like, don't at me, but seriously, I, I feel like Gen 4's fossils were to, like really shitty in comparison to like a lot of the other ones because like I'm thinking about gen 1 you had a pterodactyl you had like a, a fucking I, I don't know what kabutops is but it's awesome you had a god a snail god and then you go like gen 3 you have a giant like armadillo creature and either a prehistoric plant or a dildo I'm not quite sure which 
and then like Gen 5, you you have a turtle and you have another like another like pterodactyl looking thing. And then I don't remember if it was Gen 6 or 7 that gave us the giant Tyrannosaurus Rex, but I, I fucking love that thing so much. This guy got nothing but Buizel, really. You know, I like to imagine what's happening with Psychic, like Psychic. I'm just making his Buizel's head, like, just explode. Like, my Psyduck is literally just popping their heads. Just, like, one after another. Curse your speed priority. Dead. Can we get an F? Can we get an F for those dead Buizel? Alright, I think this is the last trainer on the route too, so that's good. Ruin Maniac Brian. Don't worry, I got Water Pulse. I'll make sure you're dead right quick. You'll be dead quick, fast, and in a hurry. I promise. Deceased AF. War pulse the shit out of him. Bulldoze. I don't know if that did a surprising amount of damage or if I was kind of like injured already. Either way, I don't like you. Bronzor. Uh, your problem. I don't have anything to deal with you. I do have this lad, though. I have Big Venus. My name is Big Venus. The biggest Venus of all. Oh, that was a crit. Okay. Well, you're dead now, so that's fine. God, Bronzor is the most do-nothing Pokemon ever. Rick Gastly leveled, that's good. I don't remember if there's an Air Ruin Maniac up here. If there is, we'll beat the shit out of him too. No, there's just a cave, okay. Fantastic. I feel like there's no new Pokemon this route, I could be wrong. But, well, we're on a new route now, and it's Beaveril. We have that. We can't catch it. Please, God, let this not be a repeat of last video where I walked through the grass, and when I was trying to leave it, literally made me fight like, oh no, it's happening again. Nope, no, nope, we're using repels. We're using motherfucking repels. This is insane. I'm not having this happen again. I refuse. Oh god, I don't know if there's gonna be an revival bell. I need to heal, just in case. That just occurred to me. Like, that was the horrifying thought I just had. I'm like, what if there's an revival bell? I'm not prepared for this shit. Repel. Paralyze heal, yes. Good, good heal. Damn it. I want to see if I can trick him. Nope. I think I have to be on the bike to do it.
Nope. I think they might have fixed him. I think that's what the patch was for. I'm gonna try it like one more time. Nope. Okay, I don't think Union Sequence Break the same works as I know if you activate a prompt right as you went to pass him before, it would actually let you skip. Let's go into the Battle Cafe. Famous last words. Wait, I, I think it's double bells, right? Okay, yeah, I'm good. Yes, small child, let me beat you up for XP. I need it. I have to fight Maylene. And Maylene is strong. As we witnessed last playthrough, her Pokemon are ridiculous. Rubber Ducky and Bolt. Uh, so I don't know, I don't think it'll be super effective, but I know it'll be somewhat effective against the Wooper if I, if I Ice Beam him. That Meryl's incredibly dead, though. Like, that Meryl is laughably dead. Like, I don't think there's a word to describe how dead that Meryl actually is. No, I'm not gonna borrow Learning Bolt Switch. Well, didn't matter if it was super, because that whooper is dead. A palm. Little monkey fellow. Confusion. Tackle. That should be dead. How fast is the Psyduck? Like, I'm, I'm starting to question the Psyduck speed, because it seems to be outspeeding everything. Bird up leveled. The, the feeling when you think you're going to take on two gems in one video, and then the game's just like, no. Oh, 34, okay. Yes. Yes. Get biggest burb. Emo bird. Bird up. Yes, close combat. Oh, Maylene doesn't know how dead she is. Actually, I feel like with that, we can actually take her on just with the, uh, just with the Star Raptor. Because I'm just thinking we can Aerial Ace whatever our first two Pokemon are, and then we can close combat the Lucario. Why are you like this? Why are you the way that you are? At least we're getting lots of XP. Die. How are you alive? I have so many questions. Kill it. Let's fucking kill it. Yes, it's dead. Another Goldeen, really? Man, these uh these private investigators really like their Goldeen. You know what I really like though? I like dead Goldeen. That's that's my preferred type of Goldeen, is the dead kind. Where they're no longer alive. Why why do you think it's luck? There's nothing to do with luck. Let's battle these two. Then there's one more set of people we have to battle here, and then I think we'll just head to the gate, heal up, and then go kill Maylene. 
I'm trying to think if we'll actually be able to, uh... I'm trying to think if we'll be able to actually do Crash or Wake or not, because, I mean, it's a straight jog down after Maylene. But at the same time, I'm questioning it. Oh, that's a dead Bidoof. That is definitely a dead Bidoof. And that's a super dead Machop. I don't think it could be any more dead if it tried, honestly. Nair Doof. More Doof. All the Doof. Okay, well, this seems pretty easy. Psychic on the Bidoof. Bite on the Bronzor. Yes, it's dead. Good. One hit kill. Please stop that. That's quite annoying. Yes. Big Venus got an air level. I feel like maybe it does evolve with the War Stone, because I don't know. How am I Pokemon doing? Oh, they can easily take on these last two. Okay. And then after these two, we can go. And we can fucking just absolutely... Words escape me. I, I forgot what I was saying. Oh, yeah, we can go fight the gym. I'm, I'm good. I'm good at wording, I swear. Um. Oh, I'm out of psychics. That's unfortunate. War pulse the Mr. Mime kill the Psyduck. We know how deadly Psyduck can be. We've learned that today. That's a dead Mr. Mime. May it rest in pieces. Rubber Ducky leveled. Psych up, no. My tiny yellow burb is awesome. Okay, there. Oh wait, I don't think we fought those two old people. Damn it. Oh, we're about to find out. Yep, okay. We didn't fight them. Damn it. Whatever, the more levels the better. It's fine. We need the XP. Sexy Bunny. Sexy Bunny needs to die. Die, monster. You don't belong in this world. Ice beam. Electrocute the shit out of the bunny. Excuse me? Oh, yeah, that's right. I did. Never mind. I thought I had done it to the Starly. I'm stupid. No, I ice beam the Starly. I was about to pull an Aaron Hansen and blame the game for my stupidity. Oh, that thing is dead. Tackle it. Kill it. I don't know what it's doing. I don't like it. Well, it's dead. Whatever it was doing, it's not doing it anymore. So, that's good. Freeze her, his fucking owl to death. It must die. Weird one-legged owl monster. Glammy owl. 
Easy. Easy win, boys. Easy fucking win. Die, please. Yes. Now finally we can go fight Maylene. Yes. Yes, heal me, please. Oh, thank God. Oh, that's the last time I can ever use him. Now, as far as I remember, the only one of those left... The literal only one of those left is the one on the, uh, the snow route. God, this game controls like shit. Oh wait, there's a thing. Yeah, I, I noticed the thing. I need it. Big root. No! We already have it, we can't catch it. Fine. Oh, I'm just happy we can go beat my, like, uh, Maylene. Once we do that, I'll call it a video, because I thought we were going to go take out Crasher Wick 2, and we could actually, we do have the time, but I'm just like, I don't, I don't really feel like doing that. You gotta understand, it takes a lot to edit these videos. Because it's not just like, oh, I have to do standard editing. I then have to put the overlay on. Actually, you know what? Just to make sure that we actually kill her. Let's give it the fist plate. So that way we can boost the power of, uh... We can boost the power of close combat. I didn't mean to do that. Yes. Oh, what was that glitch? I just like clipped through the fucking thing. Um. What? What am I? How am I supposed to do that? How am I supposed to push that? Move this. Yes. Back when Pokemon puzzles were actual puzzles. Did I soft lock this somehow? Uh, yeah, it appears I may have soft locked this, or that glitched and is somewhere it's not supposed to be. Um, yeah, there's no way up there. I have to reset the gym. God damn it, this game. Okay, yeah, it, it was glitched before, unless I just, it wasn't showing me something, or I, I don't know, but that was definitely glitched.
There we go. Beautiful. 10 out of 10. And now we just gotta do the air side. Push that. Nope, that's wrong. That's fucking wrong. I need to push this one too. God, yeah, they really need to fix the movement in this game. I know they won't, but Jesus Christ, look at the fucking game freaking out whenever I try to move. Good. Line these up. Go through here. Alright, bitch. Time to die. Tell me I put my Star Raptor up front. Why do I feel like I forgot to do that and this is going to end catastrophically because of it? Meditite. Okay, you boy remembered. Good. Best burb. Kill in one hit. Yep, good fucking buy. Bolt leveled. And it's just gonna send in Machoke Me Daddy. That's fine though. Now the hilarious thing is too, if I don't kill this Lucario in one hit, it kills me. Like 100% if I don't kill in one hit, we're saying goodbye to Bird Up. I hope it is. I truly, deeply hope that this is the end. Because I really hate your Lucario. Okay, die. Yes! It's dead! One of the three big threats is dead. Rick Gastly leveled. Yes, we beat her. Yes, t shut up and take my badge. I get it. Great. Okay, well... I think with that, we're going to leave, and then uh, I think we'll get, I think, Fly from Dawn. I can't remember. We'll, we'll do whatever the interactable thing is with Dawn, and then we'll call it a video. Oh, you bet your ass I'm teaching Drain Punch to Machoke. It can't learn it. It can learn Flamethrower, but it can't learn Drain Punch. Also, I was saying there's something new under Mr. Gift. What, what you got? What's new? Anything exciting? What do we have? Oh, it's just the same shit. Never mind. I, I thought it was like Dark Rise now available or some shit, but no. It was just lies and bullshit. Oh, hey. You. I'm gonna heal because I have the right to do that now. Not that I took damage, I'd just be restoring PP, but fuck it. I don't care. Alright, so I'll heal. And then we'll go do whatever that thing is with her. I think she gives you fly. So, might as well do that. And then we'll call it a video. A vidyat, if you will. Oh. I, I didn't know that was what you wanted. Hang on. I'm willing to help you. Just, just give me a minute. Alright. Yes. 
I need I need duct. Good duct. Okay, well I can kill both of those things, but the dust ox is significantly more dead than the beauty fly. Yeah, that's that's pretty dead. Never mind, it somehow lived through that. Oh, Clefairy. Oh, wow, it didn't die. As a bulky Clefairy. Good. Uh, sleeps with its eyes open. Uh, look at it. Dustox is dead. That's good. You know, if I had actually remembered this was a battle, I would have healed after the battle. And not before it. That was very stupid of me. The good news is, I'll be able to sweep the entirety of Crasher Wake with Lux Ray, like, next video. So we'll just have another Pokemon Center after that. Oh, I'm not even wasting a Psychic on you. I'm just going to use Confusion, because you're four times weak to me. Yeah, if it didn't die in one hit, I'd be concerned. That beauty fly needs to die. It's being very annoying. Ice Beam, kill it. Yeah, one hit, yeah. Ice Beam, yeah. It's dead, yay. Big Venus leveled. Stomp, no. What, what's, what's their last? Stunky. Oh, that's quite annoying. Let's water pulse it for the same type attack bonus and potential confusion. Oh, that's quite awful. Don't do that. Why would you waste a turn growling at it? You could have killed it with disarming voice. You easily could have killed the damn thing. You bungus. Yes, they're dead. Wonderful. Good. Shut up and take my Pokedex. You're not gonna give me fly? Okay, well fuck you too, bitch. Okay, well, we'll go to Pastoria next video. I'm just gonna guess in position to do so, and then I'm gonna save. So yeah, we're, we're making good progress. Like I said, I think next video we'll take out Crash or Wake, do the Safari Zone stuff, and then do the steps for Fantina, and then the video after that we'll do Fantina. Probably Fantina, then Byron, then Candace, honestly, in a row. It should be pretty easy. I mean, our Ponyta, I'm assuming it's going to be Rapidash by the end of the next video, is really going to shine in, like, the, the two gyms after fucking Crash or Wake. Uh, no, after Fantine. I was going to say Crash or Wake, but no, he's water. And she's ghost. Okay, well, I'm going to save. And next time, we'll, we'll take out Crash or Wake. We'll do all that stuff. So, yeah, that's going to be it.